Hi, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Cammie and this is Cammie's Closet. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for coming. I would appreciate it if you would hit the subscribe button below and the bell notification so you'll be alerted when I put videos up and you can come back and watch them. If you're not new to my channel, thank you so much for coming back. Um, very quickly, I just want to do, I want to show you what I'm still selling that nobody's buying. Why is nobody buying my bags? Why, 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 why? Somebody buy my bags. These are steals. Do you guys know? These are steals. I have this Valentino gorgeous all leather red tote. Like new, literally, pristine, worn once. Comes with everything. It even has a tag. I still have the tag on it. Where's the tag? Anyway, the tag's on there somewhere. Here it is. I don't even think I wore Maybe I did wear it. Here's the tag. Comes with everything, dust bag. I dropped this down to like 600. Where are you gonna find an all leather luxury bag for 600? Nowhere, nowhere. And a tote too, not a tiny little micro bag, a tote. I'm also selling this Fendi, I dropped the price on this. Under a thousand, it has a, a crossbody strap. I'm not gonna go through all the details, I just wanted to show you guys. This Fendi mini, by the way, gorgeous bag. Again, Fendi Mini, by the way, pristine, used maybe once, under a thousand. You'll never ever find deals like this. It's like Crazy Eddie. You're never going to find deals. These prices are insane. <laughs> My Balenciaga, gorgeous bag. Not sure why I'm selling it. Might be that peer pressure. You know, there are a little controversial stuff going on with them. I absolutely adore this bag. Again, maybe wore it once, pristine condition. Uh, well under what I paid I'm selling, well under. Gorgeous, gorgeous gray with silver hardware. I don't even think, I, I don't even think I'm gonna sell it, but if somebody gives me what I'm asking, then I'll sell it, gorgeous. Everything is for US residents only. I take Venmo, no returns, obviously. It's just too much, it's too much work. I can't, I'm not a store. You know, you buy it, you buy it. Um, this is the only thing that's not in pristine condition. And I mentioned this a thousand times. It has a couple of little dots. I don't know where it's from. I think when I went to get my hair highlighted, it sprayed. See the little dots right there? You can't really see them in person. They're more obvious on the screen. Now, of course, my lighting is getting bad because it was nice and sunny until I got home and now it's cloudy. So now my lighting is going to crap. Anyway, so I have this for sale. If you're interested in anything, this has this comes with the dust bag, the receipt. If you're interested in anything, please, I'll put my email down below. Go look at my community post. Just put these up. I'm selling these. They're new with tags. The Wizard of Oz, Tin Man, and Scarecrow. I'm selling them. They got to go. They just sat in the plastic for about, I don't know, two years. Got to go. They got to go. They got to go. And um, I think... I think that's it, except for this. I don't know why no one's buying this. I'm selling this like on Poshmark. It's Michael Kors, it's orange, it's a beautiful orange. It's in perfect condition except for, I got this on the Real Real. I think this was the first purchase I ever made and I don't make too many there and I won't, but this was before YouTube, before I even knew anything about the Real Real. There's a little bit of the piping that we, I, you know what, I can't even see it, but there's a little piping that's off in the very, very corner. It was not listed like that. But what did I know? I didn't even notice it till months later. In any case, it's a great, it's a great bag. And I, I don't know, I'll, I'm practically giving this away, literally. I'll give this bag to someone for like 60 bucks. Shipping, insurance, everything, 60 bucks. I mean, I, can you get any lower? I just don't have the room. So, how many nosy people are out there? Look at my hair standing up in all kind of weird ways. How many nosy people are there out there? Do you really care what's in my bag? If you do, I'm going to show you. If you don't care, yeah, you could click out. 
This is the bag I've been using literally the whole week last week. Like I, I didn't change out my work bag the whole week, including today. I, I just sometimes I just get too tired. So let me show you. I have my uh, glasses for my phone, for my phone, my iPad in here, because it's a different set of different pair of glasses that I use for my computer, which should be in here also. I now have this in here, and in here I have Blistex, the individual hand sanitizers, a little perfume. I think that's pretty much it. I love this little thing. Thanks, Yoda, for making me get it. Then I have my coach. I don't know, pencil case, whatever. I have a Tide Stick Fly Away Hair Serum. It's like a, a mascara, and you could put your little flyaways down. Tylenol. God knows why I have this Tylenol when I have a whole nother bottle in here. I, it just, I carry too much crap. It makes no sense. Where is it? It's the same thing. I have Tylenol in here, Motrin, Aleve. Makes no sense. And my Chanel. Is this my Chanel? I don't even know. Can't see without my glasses. Is this Chanel? I have no idea. Oh, yeah, it is. My Chanel balm, lip balm, that I haven't used. In the box, that's in here, too. And my tweezers. Yes, Yota. Tweezers. Really good tweezers. To get that witch hair off my chin that grows right there. I got that. So I got these things so far in the bag. Then I have my zippy wallet. I have half of an insert. Not the whole insert, just kind of half, where I keep another lip balm in this lipstick holder. My lipstick, my color, my MAC lipstick the Tylenol, another hand sanitizer, like as if I don't have enough in this thing. It's ridiculous. My hair thing, I just keep on there so it doesn't scratch anything else. And a full Crabtree and Evelyn hand cream. Oh, I got a pen here. Oh, and just in case I need my emergency vitamin drink. So instead of the whole insert, I just put like half an insert along with all this other stuff. And then I have my work phone, which hasn't been charged in, in a couple of months, but don't say anything. And then I have this pouch, which is empty. <laughs> Why is it in there? No clue. My mini readers. And last but not least, not least, in here, my Louis Vuitton micro. Come on with this. Ugh, I get so aggravated. <laughs> I'm tired. My micro Matisse. Yes, you people think I'm just saying that. I'm not just saying that. I keep a micro bag in my work tote because when I run out I don't want to take a whole work tote I don't want to carry a big heavy obnoxious thing so I keep it right in the tote whatever bag whatever micro bag I'm gonna take I put it in there oh I left my other glasses on my desk at my office that's okay It's a lot of crap. A lot of crap that I don't need. Oh, and my keys in my YSL. That, you know, stays in here too. It's heavy. Don't get me wrong. This bag is heavy. It's definitely heavy. Um, 
the reason I wanted to do a what fits, not what fits, well, it is what fits. It's a lot of crap that fits. What's in my bag is because I was talking to Dawn and Yoda, and I will put their channels below. I want to use my smaller bags for work. I want to use, now I don't mean, you know, a little bag like this for work. I want to use like a medium bag for work. I want to start using my bags. My bags are sitting in my closet. They're not getting used. It rained three weekends in a row, so I couldn't even take out, you know, any bags that I wanted to. It rained three weekends so far in a row. I don't know what's going to happen this coming weekend, but I take a bag that I'm not concerned about, so therefore my other bags don't get used. I want to start using my bag. So everyone is saying, you know, Yoda, Dawn, they said, well, take a small bag for just your essentials because you have everything in your office that you need and take a separate tote to carry like your lunch bag in and a couple of other things, maybe an umbrella, whatever. I don't even take an umbrella to work. I have it in my car. I carry a lunch bag. I carry my work tote and I have a cup of coffee in my hand and I have to unlock a gate and I have to unlock the door to my building because I'm by myself. I have nowhere to put these things. If I took a smaller bag and then had to take another tote, that's just another additional thing I have to carry. Why do I need to take two types of hand sanitizers in this bag? I have hand sanitizer in my office. My office is 12 minutes from my house. So I said to Dawn and Yoda, I said, well, what happens if I get caught in like a hurricane halfway there? And like, I need my tweezers, right? Because if I'm going to be rescued, I don't want to have a hair hanging off my chin. What do I do? I, you know, I, it's just too much. It's unnecessary. I have two bottles of, of, of medication in there. Tylenol separate in another case with my other case that has the, the, the Motrin and the, I mean, it should all be in one thing. I don't need to take two separate. I don't need two lip balms. I don't need um, two types of hand sanitizers. It's, it's really, it's a little bit nuts. It's a little nuts. Um, so give me your suggestions. Give me your ideas. If you could think of something else other than another tote, I'm trying to not have more to carry. Let me know in the comment section. Another tote. How do I get rid of things that I don't really need without feeling like I need them? Like, oh no, what am I going to do without them? I, I got I to gotta figure it out. But in any case, before you go, I just want to show you because it's the first time I'm wearing, no, it may be the second time, my new earrings. My Lagos earrings that I got in TJ Maxx for about 60% less than they would have been. I got this on too. Also a TJ Maxx Lagos that also was about 60-65% less than they sell. And these are still available on Lagos. They're still available in Neiman Marcus. The same with the earrings. So it's not like they're discontinued. They're still available and I got them for literally 60-65% less in TJ Maxx. I got my Movado watch, my two-tone. I was, I was doing two-tone today. Oh, and here's my Lagos bracelet with the pyramid. Matches the earrings. So, um, you know, and my, uh, my regular wedding set. So I'm uh, a lot of uh, gold silver today, and, you know, that, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to come on here, show you guys everything I have, Spread the word, look on my community post, email me if you're interested in any of these bags and, um, or maybe the coach bears and tell me what you think. Like what, what, how do I downsize what I carry without feeling like I'm going to be lost without something? Like I got to have it. I need it. I got to be with me. I mean, two medicine bottles. That's just, it's just. And I have it in my office. I have my own office. I do not share an office. I have my own office with drawers full of snacks and medical supplies and Neosporin and Band-Aids and a hairbrush and poopery. Everything. I don't need anything. How do I get past it? Tell me, guys. 
and come back on the weekend a good collab coming up with my bad girls the damage we did in philly and i have a few other things coming see you soon